Ladies and gentlemen, this is War Games. And as you can hear from Keith, two competitors in the ring at the same time. There are four members on each team. The match does not officially start until all four members are in the ring. If any of these men escape the cage, they will be disqualified. But nonetheless, oh, Mason Martin and Austin Everett starting out for their teams. Mason Martin representing Tim Taylor and the Dark Horses. And Austin Everett representing Mad Max and the New Army. Okay, well, I guess I was wrong about that. I guess I was wrong about that cage situation, but uh, whatever. My head's my head's all messed up at this moment. <laughs> but nonetheless, Mason Martin, Mason Martin has Austin Everett by the head. He's just trolling him, just carrying him around the cage, and Mason Martin just showing the face of Austin Everett to all of the fans. Mason's just. Mason's just rolling around with him at the moment. And look at this now, Mason, oh, threw Austin Everett into the cage. And nonetheless, Mason Martin and Austin Everett fighting on the outside. I don't have a very good view of what's happening right now, but nonetheless, Mason Martin's just laying waste to Austin Everett. And as Keith said, every three minutes a new competitor will enter. And look at this now, Vinny Versace giving chase. He's getting away from getting away from Mason Martin. Oh, punch right to the head of Austin Everett. Mason Martin. Oh no no no. Mason Martin whips up Austin oh, into the cage. Back meets steel. And now Austin. This match has been pretty much one-sided thus far. As Mason Martin and Austin, oh, I couldn't see that, but that sounded like a nasty chop. And now they're, at the moment, I can't really see. Okay, there we go, they're back in the frame. But Mason Martin now, oh no, I don't like this. I don't like this situation. Oh, body slam on the outside. You can hear the crowd chanting beast. And now Mason Martin grabs Austin Everett by the head. And remember, three minutes. Oh, big chop. Who's next? Mad Max! Mad Max Morrison representing the new army in this match as Max giving a handicap against Mason Martin at the moment Kind of a care package as now Austin Everett and Mad Max just laying waste to the Baltimore Beast. And there's another slam into the cage from Austin Everett. But oh, wait, no, 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 he is not good. Oh, just runs him into the cage. Oh, and there's a splash. And oh, oh and another. See, this is just a. This is just about of seeing who will survive and if their bodies can last the torture that is war games. And you, can, and you can see Vinny Versace just just talking to just talking smack to Keith Bacraft. And look at this now. They're back into the ring. Mad Max and Austin Everett. Both handicapping. Both handicapping the Baltimore Beast. And now, Austin Everett. Austin Everett just firing away 
on the head. Tim Taylor representing Mason Martin. And look at this now. Look at this nimble guy. Look at that. Top rope into a crossbody. Beautifully done. This man, he may be small, but he can lay waste. Tim, ow. The intensity of Tim Taylor is palpable. And look at, oh, Mad Max with that huge headbutt. He's known for using his head figuratively and physically. And look at this now. Telling him to get up, Mad Max, into the corner. And it looks like he's gonna, oh look at that. Beautiful exploder suplex. Toss him nearly across the ring. And wait a minute now, Mad Max, oh no. Mason Martin able to get his foot up. Oh, and again, the Austin Everett. Damon Price, one half of the Tag Team Champions. He's making his way into the ring. Now at the three on two, Damon Price, Mad Max and Austin Everett versus Tim Taylor and the Baltimore Beast, Mason Martin. And look at this now, Mad Max, oh! Squishing Tim Taylor in between the cage. And look at this, no, not again! And now Tim, Tim Taylor is just kind of laying waste. He can't, I don't think he has much energy left back in him. And now Austin Everett, Austin Everett into the corner. God, all three of these men, they just like to play around with their opponents and that's what they can, that's basically what they have to do until all four men are legally in the ring. The next Who's next? What? Oh, wait a minute. From Silver Spring, Maryland. Wait, what? Are they not here? Well, according to Vinny Versace, they're not here. I mean, the dark, we haven't seen the dark horses ever since they got buried in the casket. Back at back at EWA last rights in October, and now Damon Price. Oh, knee to the back. I guess Vinny Versace is right. I don't think we're gonna see the Dark Horses. I think it's just gonna be a handicap war games match. Well now it's four against two, and the odds of this War Games match is not good. I think that now 
that everybody, well, I can't say everybody because there's still one more count, but I mean, if one half of the Dark Horses ain't here, I guess both of them aren't. I mean, that ain't good in the slightest. And now just Tim Taylor and Mason Martin just handicapped. And the new army, Austin Everett and Mad Max all just, just taking it in. Vinny Versace saying it's in the bag. Vinny Versace saying four on two, and that's right. I mean, I don't think it's gonna be, I don't think they're gonna be able to get in there. Oh my God. Beautiful. The next randomly chosen competitor and final competitor will enter the ring in 10, 9, Are they actually going to show up? 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Will they actually be here, though? I guess not. It looks like we're just going to have a 4 on 2. So I get. Oh, come on. Vinny Versace asked for a microphone. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. The lights are gone out. Oh, no way. No way. Are they here? No, they're not. Are they really here? Are they? Are they here? Are they here? all stare oh they're here the dark horses are back and now Mad Max and Austin Everett lay waste but the dark horses are gonna fight back Austin Everett and, the, and oh my god oh throwing him into it the dark horses have arisen from their grave oh Jesus they have arisen from their grave they are back in EWA. And look at this now. We got a new army and the Dark Horses going to each other. You can already feel the intensity in the ring as the Dark Horses, they're just firing away on the new army after they, after they took the tag team titles up from them back at last rights. Risen from the grave is the Dark Horses. Oh, look at this now. Oh, Grizzly O and Tomahawk. Signature Dark Horses. Grizzly O, oh. but Mad Max, uh, well that wasn't a smart move, Max, as now you're being taken away by both Grizzly O and Tomahawk. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, lawn darting him right towards the cage. Face first. Now they can actually go for pinfalls and submissions. They can actually go for pinfalls and submissions in this match. And now Austin Everett makes his way back into the ring. And look at this now. Tim Taylor countering. Oh, German suplex. Delivered to Austin Everett. It's a lot of chaos to keep up with as eight men in the ring. Oh, wait a minute now. Tim Taylor, top rope. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, that wasn't a good idea. Not a good idea, as Hyde has Tim Taylor by the throat on top of the cage. Oh, wait a minute now. Hyde, he's having trouble. But wait. Oh no! Now Damon Price making his way up towards him as well. But wait. Oh my God. And now, and now the Dark Horse is trying to, oh my God. Oh my God, this is gonna be one of the most ring-breaking things I have ever seen. And now Mad Max, oh my God. Tower of Doom. Doomsday is here and War Games. Oh my 
God! Somebody cover someone! Mad Max! Oh my God! And now he's gonna pin Tim Taylor, but no! Mason Martin able to counter, able to get the pinfall out from under, out from under Mad Max. And now Mason Martin, oh! Right to the back with an elbow. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. Mason Martin going to the top rope now. Oh my God, no. Mason's going to the top rope. God, we just saw a Tower of Doom with six people. Oh, wait, nope. And now Mason Martin trapped on the top rope as Damon Price fires away. But look at this now. Oh, just slings him off. Vinny Versace saying, how do you like him now? Oh, Jesus. Huge kick to the face. Oh, wait a minute now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Top rope. This is not a good idea. This is not good. Damon Price. Damon Price has him in position. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. He's gonna go for the rolling hills. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Spinning rolling hills from the top rope. And into the pin. One. Two, oh no, Austin Everett breaks up the pinfall. I'm losing my voice over here. Oh man, and look at this now, sent off a, oh no, no, no. Austin Everett countered, oh look at this, sunset! And into the two, but no, Hyde able to kick out. God, eight men in the ring. They're all trapped. So I don't know how they're gonna get the pimp how any man's gonna get a pinfall in this match. And Hyde. Oh. Returning punches back and forth. Oh, right to the face. And the Dark Horse is now, it looks like they're gonna. Looks like they're gonna team up on Hyde and Everett. And look at this now. Damon Price rolls to the outside. Cage door open. And Tim Taylor now going after Mad Max. And the Dark Horse is going. Oh my god! Mason Martin, top rope! Oh my god, no! Mason Martin! Oh my god! I cannot believe what I just witnessed. God, these men putting their bodies on the line for the sake of a victory. It's not about championships. It's about the will to win. And now the Dark Horse is, oh, looked like they were gonna team up on Damon Price, but Damon Price now firing back. But wait a minute now, Damon fighting back. Off of the rope, oh no, no, no! Oh, whoa, 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 oh my God! And look at this now, they're gonna double cover. Two, three, and Neo! Yes, that's it! <laughs> 